All right, it's that time once again for another Alterac Valley, December the 9th, 2022. Looks like Alliance only had three healers and three tanks. That's a little bit interesting. We got 24 people in it from the SAS crew. This is probably not going to be a good day for the Alliance <laughs> just because Blizzard fucked them over on the matchmaking. Don't forget to hit that like, share, subscribe, notification bell. Got the finish line up. We're going to hold here at the Ice Blood Choke Point here. Make sure nothing gets south. We'll see if anybody actually makes it by. Galv, they're on Galv, okay. Well, let's rush over to Galv, see if we can save Galv. Galv's going down fast. We got to get in here, man. Lots and lots of AoE stuns need to go off right now. We've gotten 11 kills so far. They've only killed one of us. Probably the person at Shiggy. <laughs> There's only one hunter at Stonehearth Graveyard right now. We are starting to slowly clear him out of here. Can we save Galv? It's close, man. 16%. Yeah, I think we got it. They're going to wipe here. We're going to save Galv. And then we're going to have to start pushing through everything. We do not have anything tapped Northfield at all. <laughs> Pretty much our entire team was sitting there. I'm going to go ahead and get Snowfall, of course. Got to have Snowfall when you want a turtle. Start chasing down some in the field. We have somebody guarding Snowfall. That's good. Get some kills here on the way. Heading back up to Snowfall to make sure it doesn't get flipped over to the Alliance. Got the flag on your ass. We're good there. Had to recall back to the base. Nobody was guarding West. And East looks like there's somebody here. Oh, there they are. <laughs> Hiding in stealth, were we? That's fine, though. Should be okay here. We got more than enough time to actually get East back. We got a tap on SHB, and looks like we got people conversion on Icewing, and we got Stonehearth Graveyard flipped right now. Take out this. Nope, blinded him before he could interrupt. Stun. Good, they got it back in time. He was going up there and trying to interrupt us capping the flag. Did not make it, though. I like this. So far, the map is red mostly. We just got to get Ice Blood Tower back. And looks like there's still somebody in the base. They just capped West again. This healer here is being a pain in our neck, though. <laughs> Let's just go ahead and see if we can get a knockback for him. Yeah, knock him off down that way. <laughs> Glider over here to west. Got to work on the Death Knight next. What cooldowns do you have left, Mr. Death Knight? Let's find out. Using some carrying abilities. Yeah, backstab still hits like a wet noodle. I disarmed the DK. Not sure it has the same effect as if you disarm, you know, like a warrior or a rogue, but still, you got to use it whenever you can, right? <laughs> no, nice. You got knocked off there. I'll take on the pet. Somebody get the tower back. The pet should die. No, he's pulling the pet away now. <laughs> I mean, really, does it even matter? Can he just resummon the pet if it dies? <laughs> should be able to take him out. Yeah, he's dead. Finish him off there. Now we got to get the healer down next. I think this is kind of interesting, too, because they took Stonehearth Graveyard back, so they resurrect there. We had to come back and try to get Snowfall again. They have a warrior guarding it, a tank. We still have a tap on Stonehearth Bunker and Icewing Bunker. Looks like we just reclaimed Stonehearth Graveyard as well. Yeah, while we had both bunkers being burned, we could converge on the graveyard there. <laughs> Knock the tank down. <laughs> Reclaim the graveyard. It caps immediately because it was already ours. Stonehearth Bunker is burning right now. Icewing going to go down next. Yep, there it is. That's two down. And look at the score already. 371 to 691. A healer right here in the middle field. No, not going to do much damage there. Heading north. Back on the DK. Morn Frost. I got it. Frost mourn, right? <laughs> Gonna have to mourn your death, though. Loot the dead-ass body there. We got a priest that wanted to go here south. They're gonna try and hide him with Belinda. No, they're not gonna have a chance. Good night. Give me that kill there. Hold this graveyard some more. Finish off the rogue. I'll take another killing blow as well. Graveyard's gonna cap now for us. And we already got a tap on Storm Pike, so you definitely need to get up there and make sure that stays guarded. Got a tap on north, and they got one in our base right now, west tower. We got some people that have recalled, though. Hopefully, they'll be able to get it back. 
IBT was taken and then we already reclaimed it back. I'm going to recall to the base because I don't like it when towers get like a minute 30 to go. <laughs> Stun the rogue. There's two druids in here. We're going to need some heavy hitters up in here. I shadowy dueled the chicken. Not sure I have enough gas to finish it though. Trinket at that. Almost. Got him. That's one down. Just watch out for the rebirth there. That's why you always keep the other druid targeted in case you need to kick that rebirth. You never know. He might have it. Rogue's going to die here through evasion. Shadow strikes go through evasion. We already got east back. Finish off these two here and we're going to take west back as well. Yep. He should have got a rebirth off. Probably didn't have it. Would be my guess. Bye bye. Just a little nuisance, a little pest there. Now we got West back. Everything is all red except for our mine right now. Heading north here. Taking down a warrior on the way north. North bunker's got about 20 seconds to go before it burns. All the alliance that die, they're going to respawn up in their cave. And you know where they're going to be heading next? Stormpike Graveyard. Looks like we got a lot of people that are mounting up and going over there. Finish the warrior. He's dead. Loot the body there. Do I have time to get anywhere else? Nope. Going in with Galv. <laughs> they have a few people here trying to kill Galv. I guess they wanted to get some kind of mark on the scoreboard. <laughs> a station's going to cap in about eight seconds here. Had to will the forsaken that. Cloak vanished out. What if they will chase? Finish the monk. Monk's dead. Got him. Loot the body there. Finish the warrior outside. He's going to leap away. He's still dead. Got wrecked by the hunter there in the rapid fire. We're going to go and see if we can clear him out. They don't have a whole team here. I'd say about eight people here. Stay on the healer. Some of these heals are a little bit harder to kill. The evoker healers are pretty insane. Druid's Crest and Tranquility, which cannot be interrupted. We did kill the priest during it, though, so that's good. It looks like we're going to be able to wipe him here. They're already killing Van as well. Van's already down to 40%. South Bunker has not burned, so they probably just killed the South Marshal in their base. Try to finish off the Evoker now. Brevoker is your name. Death is your game. Monk's going to go down here, too. Galv is going to reset. Godlike is right. They tried to take me down. Not quite. Looks like Van died before we could reset Galv. <laughs> 7 0, man. Not bad. I will take it. It looks like Hayes had 32 0 at the top and silence number 2 with 28. May all of your random battlegrounds be epic. A thousand battles, a thousand victories. Until next time, GG for the Horde.